Alrighty, welcome back to Let's Play Street Fighter 2, and when we left it last time, the Sagat was trying to hit me in the head. So, in 3, 2, 1, and... Fight! Fight, indeed! Ugh. Now, let me think. Alright, so yeah, as I, as I was uh, saying... Whoa! Oh. Jimmy. Thank you! I was going to say... Oh. Um, sorry, as I was saying uh, last time, I've spent so much money on GOG.com over the last few years. For, I mean, there's many reasons for it. Well, I say many. Uh, primarily there's two. Uh, first being, I can't stand DRM. You know, I've made an occasional exception and I tend to get bitten in the arse when I do. When I have done so, rather. Um, so, the fact that the games on GOG.com are DRM free is an absolute bonus. But also, too, um, they're releasing GOG good old games. And a lot of them are games I've always wanted to play, but for whatever reason, either because I didn't have uh, the money or the system to play them on. Um, I sort of missed out on them first time round, so it's uh, great to not just, or well, to basically relive the games I never got a chance to relive. Uh, of course, I'm getting terrible at actually finishing them. <laughs> Though, having said that, Fallout was absolutely. Oh, yes, uh, incredible. Um. Anyway, yeah, so. Oh, yeah, of course, because I was talking about um, falling into the habit of not reading a manual. Ugh, if I could remember these things, that would be handy. So, yeah. Um, and um, recently, uh, with the addition, uh, they added EA to their publisher list. Oh, yes. Oh, God. Um, and. Uh, whoa! Whoa! And, um, well, the first games that were released, uh, oh, bloody hell, got released, there was a Dungeon uh, Keeper and Wing Commander Privateer. Um, they also released Ultimas 1 and 2 as a sort of combi pack, but, um, nah. But I, I did buy, um, Dungeon Keeper, which I've played before, and, uh, Wing Commander Privateer. And I fired up Privateer to... Whoa! That was dumb. Uh, to have a look at it. And I did so without bothering to read any sort of documentation. Oh, yes! And because that's just, unfortunately, that's sort of the habit I've regrettably fallen into, but that's probably because a lot of the games I've bought, um, certainly of the newer games, the controls have been basically been quite intuitive to be fair and just, but you know I and I, I spent like five minutes just <sighs> floundering not knowing what the hell to do how to do anything and prompted me to uh, download well I already downloaded all the um, manuals and everything but I actually uh, cracked open uh, the manuals. Ah, oh, damn it! So close. Um, just to see what all the controls are, are do. So I'm gonna have another proper go at it. But it occurs to me, thinking on it, that I mean, as we're starting to see, if a game did that these days, it'd just be lambasted for not having, you know, tooltips pop up to tell you what to do, having the audacity to force you to read the manual. Ah, <sighs> strange, strange times. <clears throat> anyway, also I suppose um, it's a case of trying to bloody get off my orange hair, you goit! Um, trying to find a uh, happy medium between the need to read a manual and the need to have a computer science degree to be able to get the game to uh, play. Yes. Oh, but anyway, uh, very quickly though, before I forget or whatever, 
again. Um, yes, yeah, so I just realised that uh, at the end of the Honda playthrough, um, I just, when I was uh, beat up by some, I just randomly mentioned something about Roll Julia. Well, there was a reason for that. Um, at the time I was recording it, uh, the Adams Family movies had just been re-shown on uh, British television. On, um, I think it was on Sky Living we showed it on. What the hell? How am I being thrown around like this? Rango! Um. Yeah, and uh, I just, I just, you know, I'd planned on, but obviously uh, various interruptions prevented this, or rather prevented my scatterbrain memory from remembering it. Yeah, that was it. Um. Just mentioning that uh, the casting in the Adams Family movies was absolutely perfect. I mean, damn it, Raul Julia was nothing short of incredible as Gomez Adams, and um, yeah, and it's a crying shame oh, for sake. that um, yes, <laughs> a crying shame that. But, um, yeah, can't get the DVDs over here. Jimmy! Are you my long lost son, Jimmy? Oh my goodness, this is awesome. Who are you? Why would I be your son? My name's Blanca. My son was lost in an airplane, aeroplane, airplane crash over Brazil when he was only a little boy. Wait! That anklet! I gave that to you on your birthday. Oh, oh. Mummy. No, sorry. Mummy. Jimmy. Oh. Oh. That's beautiful. Oh, that! Oh, that! I, that is a lovely, lovely ending. Oh. <laughs> well played, Capcom. Well played indeed. But yeah, I'd rather um quickly going back to the Adams Family. Uh, no, you can't get um you can get the Adams Family values over here. But you can't get the original Adams Family on DVD in the UK. You can only um, get it on Region Two, uh, Region Two on uh, Region One, which is a uh, North American, which is annoying to say the least. Anyway, oh, so that's Blanket done. With an absolutely lovely ending. Well, it's some interesting how the searches for all these. Uh, uh, Jimmy's Jimmy, Jimmy's mother's search took her to Thailand at exactly the right moment, but oh, it's lovely, wasn't it? And despite not getting first place as Blanca, I have done it in a new record time. Very interesting indeed. Hmm. I wonder how long it's going to take me to do it as, um, legs there. Hmm. Not really much more to say, so, yeah, let's just enjoy it. One thing I do like about um, uh, Street Fighter 4, having played it properly now, um, and obviously by extension um, Super Street Fighter 4 and Arcade Edition, are the um, animated <laughs> um, intros 
and extras, the or prologues, epilogues, whatever, um, all the characters get. It's um, quite cool. <laughs> I've never seen that before in my life. Dual Tatsumiki Simple Gekos. Ah, well, didn't that go well? So it's 30,000 points. It's not too shabby. So, uh, that was Let's Play Street Fighter 2 as Blanka, and when we come back next time, ooh, I wonder who it's going to be. Bye-bye.